Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Also, hello and welcome if you're new around here. My name is Harriet, but most people call me Haz. And yeah, I have four pugs. You could just see one of their butts in the background just then. That was little Grace. And I was going to show you the, the pugs, but Rose is currently licking Molly's butt. So we've got a bit of butt licking going on down there. Rose! That's disgusting. This is little Rose, and she's the cute one. You probably figured, um, not so cute now. Then we have Molly. Oi, Rosie, stop it. And then we have Mario in the background. He's cleaning his paws. And then we have little Grace here. She is the black devil. We call her the black devil because she's just so naughty. Hang on, my camera's all on the wonk. Okay, feels really wonky. But yeah, today I'm going to be going down to the city to meet my cousin Emily. I'm really excited about it because I've got all their Christmas presents wrapped up. So Emily's got two cute little sons called Vinny and Ollie. I probably talk about them all the time over on my Instagram and in my like videos. And I actually meet them practically, I think, like once a week. And I've never vlogged it. And I thought, you know, your girl's going to vlog it today. Also, comment down below if you've done all your Christmas shopping. Are your presents all wrapped and under the tree? Because mine are actually no that's a lie I still have to get one more today but it's for Mickey's son and we just wasn't quite sure what he wanted and I think I found him the perfect gift so I'm gonna get that today and then when I get home I'm gonna wrap it and that's gonna go straight under the tree but yeah I'm really excited to go meet Vinny and Ollie because I haven't seen them for a couple of weeks now so I'm so super excited and I hope you guys are gonna be excited to meet them too so yeah I better get in the car and get down to the city because I think I'm running late already as per norm <laughs> Okay, so I'm now in the city. We've done a bit of shopping already. I'm just stopping off for lunch. We've come to McDonald's, of course. We've got a few things from Primark, but nothing like interesting, just some like cotton pads and things like that. But we're just having like McDonald's with this cute little boy. Remember what to say. Say hi, guys. Hi, guys. <laughs> what have you got? Fish fingers? Cute. And we've even got a McFlurry. Even though it's cold, we thought we've got to try that out. And there's Emily. <laughs> And then we've got a little Vinny under here, but he's asleep. Vinny! He's dreaming about bunnies and rabbits. Bunnies and rabbits are the same thing. <laughs> hey. Cheese! Cheese! <laughs> 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 Every time I get the camera out, he always goes cheese because he thinks I'm trying to take a photo, but obviously I'm recording him. So cute though. But I'm now going to tuck into like my big tasty. Oh, I can't wait for this. Don't tell Mickey though. Finny! Hello, Finny! Hello, Finny! <laughs> Say hello! Oh, look, he's saying hello! Say hello! Look at these chubby little cheeks! Oi! <laughs> We're now stopped off in Costa Coffee and look at Ollie's little heart of chocolate. Look how cute that is! Is that yours? Yeah, are you having a little nap though? Yeah? <laughs> He's having a little nap. And then we've got, look, little Robins over here. There's my friend Jess and her little son Robin. Say hi! <laughs> He's doing a little face. We've got a little Vinny. He's playing with his little elephant. <laughs> Are you going to sleep? Are you going to sleep? Aren't you going to have your hot chocolate? You gobbled down the marshmallow, haven't you? Gracie. Gracie. Is that nice? Yeah. Gracie, is that yummy? Yeah? Is that yummy? So I just got back from the city guys and um, yeah, Ma M Mario, Mickey said that Mario is really hounding Grace. We think Grace might be coming into the season. Probably that's why she's been extra moody these last couple of like days. Gracie, where are you up off to? Come here. She loves like ripping up these like toilet roll tubes. She just rips them up. She doesn't eat them. She just rips them up. Don't you Grace? Come here. Gracie. Look. She absolutely loves them. But so she's upstairs with me. But um, yeah, Dan City, it was really nice. Had a really nice time with like Vinny and Ollie having loads of cuddles and also seeing Emily. And then we also saw our friend Jess, as you saw, and Robin. And then we also met another friend, Joe, later on. We all like met up in the library and the kids like were all like reading books and playing with all the toys and stuff. So, but I just got home and my dress arrived from Pretty Little Thing. Well, I didn't actually get it from Pretty Little Thing. I got it off Depop. 
or was it eBay? I can't remember now, but it was only like £10 with like P&P and it's brand new with tags on still. I'm hoping it's going to fit. It's really nice, but I got this because me and Mickey are going on holiday for New Year's and on New Year's Day, most people will probably dress up. So I thought I'd better get something which is a bit more dressy. All the other things I've got are more like casual dresses. So I'm going to go and try this on and then you guys can tell me what you think. But yet again, excuse my legs because I forgot to shave them again so they're quite hairy. Okay, so this is the dress on and it's much more tighter than I thought it was going to be. Usually I am a size 10 for this glider, but this is a little bit more tighter, especially around like the chub area there. But once I've like sorted the undergarment out underneath, it looks all right. It's quite booby-ish, but yeah, for £10, it's just like a dress I'm going to probably only wear like once for New Year's, so it's not too bad. Sorry, this is the best view I can give you of what the dress looks like. I quite like it, like the booby bit is not too booby-ish, but it's just got that little bit of a sex appeal. Even though that little pose I just pulled is not sexy at all, but yeah. Um, oh, I don't think it's that bad. I think it will kind of go with the makeup that I like to wear all the time. Like they're kind of like ready brownie, orangey kind of like, I don't know, eyeshadow. So yeah, I think it's quite nice. Pity I didn't lose that chub before holiday, but um, that's my body, so, you know. But um, yeah, I don't mind. Sorry, I had to like come into the bathroom just because this was like the best lighting in the house, because as you can see outside right now, it's pitch dark. But yeah, I don't mind it, it's not too bad. What do you guys think of it? I feel like it would look much better if this bit wasn't like so clingy, but um, you know, when it's New Year's Eve and we go out to a party, it's going to be dark, so nobody's going to hopefully see that. But, um, yeah, if I wrinkle up the dress, it doesn't look as bad. You can't notice the podge area as much. But, as you can probably tell, because I keep going on about the podge area, I'm quite, like, conscious about that. But it's something I'm just going to have to get used to because I've always had that. But, yeah, I quite like it. It's, like, a nice little length, as you can see. Mega hairy legs. But, yeah. Comment down below what you think of this dress. Do you think it's quite nice for New Year's Eve? Obviously, I'm going to have my hair down, have all my makeup done, get my nails redone again. Then I'm going to wear some really nice, like, pink, like, heels, nudie heels. But, um, yeah, I guess this will have to do. We'll have to go and show Mickey and see what he thinks of it. Because if he definitely thinks it's a no, I'm definitely, definitely not going to be wearing it. Mama, look at my little... Oh, look at my best friend. Mm. She is so adorable. Look, look at that chubby little face. Oh, oh are you tired? Ugh, your breath stinks. Okay, if you can hear loads of noise, it's Grace and Rose are like fighting in the background. I just I looked at Grace. She had like Rose's like foot right in her mouth and was just dragging her along the floor. It's not hurting her. They're just basically play fighting. But yeah, I just thought I'd show you like my sleep because I don't think I've actually shown you yet like the finished results. Well, it's not finished finished. I think I say this every time, but I've decided that I'm going to add, I'm definitely going to add some little like, you know, design on top of the lady and then maybe I need to fill in some of the gaps here. So maybe another like kind of little flower or like a little bud or some more leaves. But I got the... I got the most painful bit done the other day. I got my elbow done with this kind of like mande or mandala kind of design. And then as you can see, I've had a few more leaves added just to fill up some gaps. And then I had this peony done on my hand, as you can see. And yeah, this is like the big sunflower. Obviously I had that done. So that's the moth and this other kind of like mandate or mandala kind of design. I always get that wrong. I never know what you call it. But yeah, I really love it. Obviously, it's quite floral and kind of leafy and yeah I didn't want it to be like one of them sleeves which is like one whole design I wanted it to be loads of like different ones especially seen as the reason why I started the sleeve is because obviously I got this done and it just wasn't really what I wanted as you can see it's quite dark compared to the rest but I feel like it's kind of like made that a little bit lighter and not look as like you know I've just got a big black dot like on my arm but I'm going to get like the top bit done up here a little bit darker and like more shaded just so then it kind of blends all in. But yeah, I really like it. Comment down below what you think of it. I know a lot of people don't really like tattoos, but at the end of the day, it's my body. It's on me and I love it. So yeah, but yeah, thank you once again, Jazz, for 
like helping me like you know complete my sleeve i'll link her instagram down below guys so go check it out and follow her and give her pictures loads of love because she's an amazing tattoo artist and yeah i feel like she's become a friend now because i've been like to see her so many times and yeah i absolutely love her she's such a lovely amazing gal so yeah thank you once again jazz but yeah that is kind of like the end of today's vlog i don't know how long this vlog's gonna be because i don't think i got that much footage down the sea just because we went to like the library as i don't know if i mentioned that earlier but we went to the library and i um, can't really film in there and but um yeah i'm now home I'm gonna edit this vlog and yeah i'll see you guys tomorrow don't forget to like watch tomorrow's vlog it's gonna be something quite different it's gonna be kind of something that i normally would do but with a bit of a twist and obviously it'll be featuring mickey again and i know you guys want to see him also wanted to say hello to all the new subscribers so hello guys and yeah thank you for subscribing to my channel i hope you're gonna enjoy like my channel and i'm definitely gonna be doing more vlogs like i said in one of my previous videos i'm really enjoying my vlogs i feel like i can be more me because i don't have to like you know sit there and kind of script like what I'm saying like when I do sit down videos I feel like I know what I'm gonna say so it comes out quite scripted so I'm really really enjoying vlogs if you'd like some more vlogs guys like in the new year after vlogmas is finished give this video a big like and then comment down below yes we want more vlogs and yeah I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video as I mentioned it's gonna be really awesome see you guys tomorrow love you all